I'm fine, Adina. I was I was away once I started the stream to get water and whatnot, because it is going to be 102 Fahrenheit today. I hate Panther. I hope it is cool where you are because it is gonna be a hundred and two today. I am, that's why if you hear a fan. I'm trying to remember if we. I guess we don't have a command for that. Oh, damn it. That weird audio ducking is happening again. Ew. Citizens only. I won't say it again. But we won't clear from arm. Well, here we go. I hope I'm persuasive. Halt! By orders of Lord Gortash, refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. Do I look like a refugee? Well, do you have the means to support yourself? Right. Article 30.1.5 of the Council's decree on extraordinary wartime measures. I am confiscating that. The city thanks you for your contribution. Your name? Damn, they're scamming us. Well met, citizen Fluffington. Your parasite stirs. From the construct, you feel connection, resonance. State your business. Oh my god. I'm a herbalist by trade, Sir Fist. My assistants and I were out collecting blooms for that. Rub rot going around. Oof, nasty business. Contagious. Aha. Uh -huh. Eyes open, body still. I'm sorry, what? Well. Why are we getting scanned well, like this is the passport gaze office? Of presence awakens. You are seen. You are known. Oh no. Your party's prior transgressions are reflected in its stare, as witnessed by the cult's ever alert, scrying eyes. It has heard the howls of slaughtered goblins. It has seen the deep shadows of Grimforge and the stone floors left well, bloodied. Shit. It knows the cold walls of Moonrise Towers and the cultists who fell there. The Watcher speaks directly into your mind with a voice Poison. like poisoned Poison. honey. You are marked for special treatment. Not simply an enemy of the people, but an enemy of the Absolute. Come quietly, or die. Oh, let's see. That's not what I wanted. 
Well, that didn't help me. Your peaceful surrender has been noted. You will be transferred to Worms Rock Prison, where you will await further sentencing. Why are we going to doing? We cannot defeat the brain without that stone. Yeah, yeah. What now? Deafening silence. Did Wint be speaking? Are y'all serious? There's like literally nothing. Hmm. Maybe I should have. Can I not wild shape? This ought shape? to be good. <gasps> I can wild shape. So, I didn't think this through. You cannot use that right now. Wow, game said no. Still breathing, despite everything. Seems like a good moment. If you're looking for sympathy, this guard has wow. none to spare. I'm not trying to get sympathy. Command would be real useful right now. Why did I do this, y'all? Why? Why did I do this? Ready and waiting. Well, certainly waiting. I can't do anything. I made a mistake. Is that blood? No, never mind. Um. This guard has no interest in speaking to a criminal. Um. Stranger than truth. So, I'm going to reload because I have no idea how to get out of jail. Um, Article 30.1.5 of the Council's decree on extraordinary wartime measures. I am confiscating that. The city thanks you for your contribution. Your name? Oh, take it up with the Duke if you don't like it. Now, your name? Well met, citizen. Your parasite stirs. 
from the construct, you feel connection, resonance. Oh, I'm a doofus. I am a steel watcher, citizen. Here to serve the people of Baldur's Gate in the name of Lord Enver Gortash. State your business. I'm a herbalist by trade, Sir Fist. My assistants and I were out collecting blooms for that rub rot going around. Oof, nasty business. Contagious. Should I fight my way into Baldur's Gate? Uh huh. Eyes open, body still. The Watcher will communicate with our new intelligence directorate. They'll determine if you're a threat to the city. Upstanding citizens have no reason to fear. And you are an upstanding citizen, aren't you? Well... Find the Watcher's gaze a presence awakens. You are seen. You are known. Your party's prior transgressions are reflected in its stare, as witnessed by the cult's ever alert, scrying eyes. It has heard the howls of slaughtered goblins. It has seen the deep shadows of Grim Forge, and the stone floors left bloodied. It knows the cold walls of Moonrise. So is anyone towers, else playing this head this problem where your audio changes when you tap in and out? Directly into your mind with a voice like. I looked it up. You I are also know how to get out of the treatment. cell now, so... Not simply an Always enemy of the people, you. but an enemy of the absolute. Come quietly. I want to see how badly a fight's going to go. So I'm going to try this once and see how badly a fight's going to go. If it goes real bad, we're going to reload. Damn, is everyone going to fight me? Oh, it's only got 145 hit points. What in the absolute well shit? Well shit. Not that maimed. Ha -ha. <laughs> oh, this is perfect. Stage fright. Need to find a way forward. You should not be able to hit me. a jump that was not a dash okay, 
that ends if I attack her. I can use telekinesis. I go hunting. Holy dog shit. I should have just gone to jail. Not a phrase I thought I'd ever say. Jesus. Ooh, boy. This is supposed to last for ten turns. Now they see me. Hey, Kaluta. Hey, Ferric. I have made the goofy decision. I kind of want to do Netheries or Blast just because. Oh. I forgot I have Ice Storm. But that is too much for right now. Oh shit! I should run. Well, that was a genius decision. Well, shit. Well, can I abjure you? I could probably take you out. actually chased me all the way over here. Oh, this is perfect. I'm gonna misty step away and let you all die. Please let it be Gale's turn. Well... Shit. Uh. Too 
the death. And that was a bonus action. Ah! I miss someone laying on the ground prone. Seriously? These boots have seen everything. How the fuck? Well, shit. Oh, you're so... Okay, that's bullshit. How do you all... I'm fading fast. I must heal. Jesus. I refuse. Oh, I'm going to murder all of you. Was that even called for? Wow. <sighs> they seriously murdered everyone? Uh, what do you mean I'm... What to do? Wow, and the game's only like, here, loot your, your boyfriend. Wow. Y'all really made... No, I'm not trying to steal from Gale, Jesus. Oh, Gale's dead dead. Take you. <laughs> Waves. There's blood in here. roll in my favor I was not trying to use all these potions of superior healing okay now you all have pissed me off
Motherfucker. How do you all have all of these actions? May the gods take you through. On my way. Hey, zero. This was a waste of time. Try me. Now I'm pissed. Death won't take me yet. Now it's your turn, motherfucker. <laughs> Come on, love. Let's get up. Need to find a way forward. Now let's see what happens. Take you. Some healing for a wizard in need. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. That was so many... Scroll or revivify. <laughs> oh, I think this one is slowing me down. <sighs> Time to get going. So, <sighs> all right. Time to see what new horrors waiting for us. Right? 
I feel like we should actually go long rest after that. Like, this is just so we can get spell slots back. Oh shit, what's up? Oh, this guy. Queen Vlakis. Scrum! You are a Sherlock, and still you speak my name. I've seen the captive Orpheus with my own eyes. Spoken to Shestil Kithrak Voss. You lied to us, enslaved us. The betrayer Voss lies! I have only a moment, and you, a Sherlock, will listen. We are Githyanki. We move mountains. We snuff out stars. We shake yeah, the plains. Yeah. The traitor Voss has lied to you. The heretic prince would shatter us in an instant. The great dominion shrunk to the head of a pin. Can this be true? Is the Githyanki prince really a threat to his own people? Or simply a challenge to Vlakith's rule? Return to the astral prism! Slay Orpheus the Pretender! Serve me, and I will ascend you. You will be no mere warrior, nor Kithrak. You will be Barta Vlakith, commander of dragons. My only, my chosen. A final chance. Kneel before me. Make your promise. Lazel's thoughts become yours. The sight of Orpheus looms over her mind. Voss's words echo within it. She means to forever turn her back on Vlacketh. I gave you my faith, and you called me traitor. I gave you my life, and you ordered your knights to hunt me. I have witnessed too much, and you have given me too little. Finally, I can see. Orpheus will live, and I will hear his creed. This is my word. Your word is nothing. You are nothing. The Kithraki will bring you. I will tear your flesh. From your bones and devour your skull's marrow while you beg for death. I will consume you. I will unmake you. Lot. I don't know why, but Vlocket is giving me big Wizard of Oz vibes. Well, that happened. Guess I should go talk to Lazel. Jesus. First in my heart. It is done. There is no going back. As long as the Undying Queen reigns, I am never to soar unbound over the Astral Sea. Never to cross the One in the Void. As it should be. Better a short life built on truth than immortality woven of lies. Better to unite the Githyanki under a prince who would free their minds and honor their bodies. So why do I feel so bitter?
You gotta be kidding me. I just need a 10. Vlakith has upended Lazel's whole existence. Everything she knew to be true, every plan and aspiration she ever oh, held has been painfully ripped uh, away. I'm near endgame or well, endish game. I just got to Baldur's Gate. Sadness. She is mourning the loss of the person she once was and can never be again. How well you've come to know me. But in truth, she didn't take everything. I have what I have gathered for myself. I'm more to a new regent, a new land, and new allies. Vlaketh cannot unmake she who no longer exists. And so from the old battle cries is birthed another. Tremar Salar Orpheus must still now forge an Yeri. Orpheus's will above all. May the comet blaze my Pretty path fair. forward. Orpheus's freedom is my want and my need. To Thank deny you, his freedom would be to deny my own. There will come a time when I can think about myself beyond the Lich Queen who enslaves the Githyanki and the Prince who would liberate them. But that time won't come until the Prince of the Comet flies again. We find Voss at Charesse's caress and retrieve the key to releasing the Prince. Orpheus tough King Narsin. The disc appears in your mind's eye. Lazel sees it too and considers the vision. Tirsu markings. Ancient. I recognize them, but I can't make sense. No. Wait. The texts are enciphered, but there's a common speech translation beneath, carved in a different hand. It's a story about... about Orpheus. Your head buzzes in concert with Lazelle's, but it hardly matters. Even without the connection, you'd recognize her discomfort. Wait, why am I asking about who's Orpheus? I am fine. The slate is not. This text is heresy. I can hardly bear to read it, let alone speak it. Very well. I will read it to you. The Prince of the Comet, Part 2. The Prince of the Comet, Orpheus himself, led his honor guard into battle. Also, I'm talking to Lazel very much, so this could just be because I haven't brought her along erupted. anywhere. The glorious prince cried to all who could hear him Praise be to my mother Gith, the queen of the one sky, sacrificed to the hells by the renegade Vlakith. But the true heir, the Prince of the Comet, could not overcome Vlakith's knights and their ill-gotten worms. Mighty Voss, Gestil Kithrak, lit the astral sky aflame. When the ash had cleared, beloved Orpheus was gone. True heir, glorious prince, Chuck. There's no greater crime than to exalt the pretender Wait a minute. Orpheus. This is Disregard really weird. This this drivel. Gith declared that Vlakith should be queen. Orpheus would have ceded control to the Gith. <laughs> Chuck, you speak like Kithrak Voss. You accuse Vlakith of the unthinkable. As unthinkable as the greatest living knight turning on his queen. Well, enough conjecture. I did what you asked, so let's be done with it. I'm not surprised. You've become death incarnate. 
Mighty, yes. And altogether unpredictable and intractable. One day, perhaps soon, Baal will demand your fealty. You'll either muster the strength to defy him, or you will succumb. I know how I choose. So we murder our way into Baldur's Gate. Um, hi. It's me, Yenna. You remember me, right? You were really nice to me before, and, um, my mum hasn't come back yet. She might come later. I don't think she's coming. Could we maybe stay here? Of course, girl. You can help me determine who it is doing all this snoring. What? Wow. Why? Why are we taking every stray kid we find? Right? Yes! You've got a fire and everything! I can cook really good! Whatever you want! Thank you, thank you! Oh my god. So, Lazel's finally seen the light and turned on her mistress. It took a little time, but she got there. Aren't you just a gaspy Though little... it's not over yet. Masters rarely let their slaves go without a fight. I was so hoping you'd say that. Until later then. Can we? <laughs> I suppose we can. <laughs> Can't get enough. I'm not surprised. No, the characters still have their own personalities. But I can make the choices I want. <laughs> you are perfect. Every time. And watch I get that weird car like dialogue again. Damn. It can't have been easy for Lazelle to stand up to Vlacketh like that. There's nothing that woman can't do. <sighs> That's a heavy weight. I know you can carry it, but it's heavy all the same. You are so much more than your parents. You're more than the affliction that wants to consume you. You are my friend. And you get to I mean, choose your destiny. I mean, Neil Newbon is on cameo. Choose well, all right? Not sponsored. Please. There you are. Where's Volo and all this? Glad to see I'm not the only one on the wrong side of an omnipotent authority figure. Lazel did well to break free of Vlakith's manipulations, though I doubt Vlakith will let such insubordination go unpunished. A Baal spawn? Gosh. I know what it is to have a closer connection than most with the gods, but with Baal, that's not a bond I'd like to be bound with. We should be careful. Very, very careful. I'm sorry, but it was the way that he just said, gosh. I just said I'm the spawn of a death god. He's like, oh gosh. Really? There's nothing that would give me greater pleasure. <sighs> the dog has something for me. I need to drink a potion. 
Oh my god, all of my careful organizing of potions is after I, uh, absolutely. Right? The dog is unable to speak through the small bag he holds in his mouth. I should have... I don't know. Maybe you can tell me. Oh, All I know is I thought of you when I saw it. A Grimishka tail. Also, there is the option when you're a dark urge to fight your dark urges, which is what I've been doing. I don't know who was here, but the other day, the game wanted me to kill Gale. Like, straight up was like, the one you love the most, you should go kill them. You smell very delicious, but I will not bite you. Nice here. The caves smell like rotting meat. Goblin coat smells like goblins. Yes, fun. Oh, what a sweet baby. <gasps> More. All right, does anyone else have an exclamation before I try to actually sleep? So there's a running theme here. I didn't think I'd live to see the day when Lazelle turned her back on Vlakith. But all things considered, good for her. I suppose that makes you quite remarkable. You worship the Though Lady of Darkness envy, and Shadow, perhaps. really? Are you trying to judge From me? From what little I can recall hearing of Baal's mortal children, not all succumb to his influence. Perhaps you can still resist your nature, if you want to. I'm going to talk to you. There's a there's a running theme of breaking free of Vlakith's your a fearsome one. religious beliefs. The sort it's hard to say no to. But, but I don't have Lazelle the range said it anyway to, to her have immense a deep credit. Conversation on She's that. choosing truth. She's choosing freedom. For her, for Orpheus, for the Githyanki people. <laughs> I wish I knew a good Githyanki cheer to celebrate the occasion, but the only gift phrases I've picked up are the sweary sort. Baldur's Gate is where I first raised a glass in toast at the tender age of 14 and got so tipsy from wine, I puked in Dillard Portier's bushes. It's where the flaming fist chased me after I'd stolen a peach from a cart in the wide. I got a good chewing out over it too. It's where my father taught me to hold a rapier, to read books of law, to know right from wrong. And yet? It's been seven years since I left. It's no paradise. But it's home, and it's worth saving. Hells, it explains so I much. I was just like, Listen I to guess. Me. I knew another like you, Gorion's Ward, one of Baldur's Gate's great heroes. Baal's blood ran through their veins too. They burned Ooh, away thanks. their own darkness with their own inner light. They chose courage. They chose honor. And so can you. I just feel like everyone's like. This is gonna be weird. But I'm actually gonna swap Jahira for Will.
I have no ideas. I'm about 60 hours into full we release We just played version. host to an undying queen. Oh. And, and some people are at 80 hours somewhere. still in Act 1. Lizelle has courage, it depends on how on much belief. you want to As explore. Us, best we stay out of interplanar politics, I think. Orpheus is on his own. But should Great Vlakit come to settle a score with Lizelle, well, <laughs> I might be convinced to kill her. Undying or not, she was very loud. Wow. You're sure? Yeah, like, like DJ. Later then. I tell you not to get in trouble, but I suspect it will find um, you whether you like it or not. DJ is barely an act two in almost a 70 hours, for example. Um, I played so much well, early access, I breezed through act one. That's the spirit. So, damn, I took everything off of Will. Took his cloak, took his spells. No weapon. Okay. I must have put that in the chest. Because he really has like zero anything. Oh, that's a long sword, okay. Some people though are hitting a hundred plus hours because they are literally touching everything in the game. They are they are making sure they leave no stone unturned. This is supposed to be just a short jaunt to camp and now look at us. Okay, where the hell are my box storage boxes? Here they are. Open up. I've almost hit 200 hours. Um, and that's including my early access play. So it all depends how much you want to explore. How much. That is a long sword. He cannot use it. I can't give him medium armor. I hate that. Why did I put that in my fucking... I thought I'd put, nope, can't put that away. I put that on Will and he hated it. I really wanna sell that psionic armor, but
Yeah, but you're embracing the evil, my friendo. Never oh. wanted the easy part. All right, let's go to bed. Let's see. And I'm well over 45 hours, so. I, d oh, what the? Oh, so this is a big spoiler for anyone, if you are playing the game. How did you? Oh, it's you. Wow. I must have let my mind wander. Enough for you to wander in. Forgive me. I am drained. Ever since you killed Catherick and took his netherstone, the Chosen's control of the brain has been brittle. So I'm it's not going to say this is since we're Gortash, just starting the game. Fiercely. I suspected that when we took Catherick's stone, the brain would begin to break free. Those brain quakes confirm that my suspicion was correct. I do not know what happens you know why my now characters when it grumpy? receives their orders. They've not gotten a decent night's sleep this whole game. Guess. You feel the Emperor's fear as if it were your own. An elder brain enslaved is one thing. An elder brain unleashed will be the end of everything. Beautiful, isn't it? The mighty Prince Orpheus, contained in submissive slumber. Come. You may as well sit a while. Now and that listen. you are here, your company isn't unwelcome. So, I'm just saying this right now. If this game gives me the option to fuck a mind flayer, do we or do we not? And I'm going to screenshot this because the last option, the last option is me IRL. Like you motherfuckers ain't let me get a single night's sleep in this game for however many weeks we've been traveling. Every time we go to camp almost, something happens. I'm also quick saving. Wow. An accurate summary. I have found myself. This is not how I thought my day would start with mind flare fucking. I'm haunted by memories. They are relentless. I can think of nothing. No one Zero. Else. Who do you think of? Wow, you have a love interest? Wow. You are not. Duke Stelmay, or Berlin, as I knew her. Wow, not Takoyaki. For her death. You Not thought Takoyaki. you were my first ally. Far from it. I have long sought the allyship of others. It is the only way to succeed. Though my relationship with Berlin was different from my relationship with you. <sighs> I'll be right back. I need something to drink if we're doing this. And I don't mean alcohol because it's only 8.30 in the morning, but I need more liquid BRB. You all talk amongst yourselves on what you think is going to happen.
I'm back. In a way. But not the way you're thinking of. In life, she yeah, was my business though. partner. Back when we ran the Knights of the Shield. A difficult task for a mind flayer. Duke Stelmane trusted me, and the city trusted her. I conceived the plot, but Berlin took center state. It was she who met with the merchants, politicians, and patriarchs. It was she who negotiated deals and signed off on agreements. Her rooms played host to the most important conversations in the city. Together, we brought order to chaos. At its height, everything that happened in that city went through the shield. Look, Reese, I... Us. I could not have I done just any show of it up. without her. Just as I cannot do any of this without you. But now, she is gone. I... And yes, Fair, I just saw your reply. Can you make a, a a fan or AC or some kind of command? Do you need a hug? Oh my god. These fucking... These fucking words... I'm gonna pick a, do you need a hug? Wow, Dre, wow. Someone please screenshot that. I appreciate the offer, but I don't think it will help. What I feel is deeper than superficial cures can reach and not entirely unwelcome. Wow. Most people think that mind flayers are soulless husks who feel nothing. I am glad you are not most people. Wow. I all I'm descending deeper into a lithid hell. Another quake. The brain is rebelling again. I need to focus. And so do you. Stop. Stop. <sighs> Did I truly, truly get... Tear up so You know I got a screenshot of the hand holding. Oh, I can't rob their bodies? I think at some point, oh, you have infernal iron. We have two pieces of infernal iron. All right, let's see what happens now that we fought our way into the gate. I mean, Astarian is literally from Baldur's Gate. I like how no one has like done any, Let's see what this does. Oh shit. Listen, it's got private rooms, music, and where are enemies folks, from what I've heard. And if a patron confuses <gasps> me for yes. a member of staff, I'd probably break his nose. Good boy. Oh blessings Why away point. Thank you. Any particular reason? reason? Between the orb and the bug, you've got more than your fair share of unwelcome passengers. What can I say? Mother always taught me to be a gracious host. 
Oh my god. Uh, I found so many victims for Kazador here. Oh. They're the kind of people no one would ever miss. The runaway is still missing after all. Nothing happens until he's found. Maybe the circus would be more open to traders? Stupid bridge guards. Should have dumped a lot of them. Be brief. Sir, good, sir. Give me three days and... Oh, I... Apologies. Thought you were someone else. Uh, greetings, so forth, so on. The landlord, Sir Frego Antuna. A most generous soul, uh -huh. I assure you. Starion. I kind of want to put a Starion in the drow armor, but I don't think he's proficient. Okay, this is the kitchen. Shall we? Also, there's no day night cycle, is there? Maybe the circus would be more open to traders? Oh. Haven't we lingered long enough? We should return for the ceremony. Oh. We have time. The runaway is still missing after all. Oh, the runaway is right here. I know I have eight million saves. Ask me if I care. Hello, friend. We should go. I do not want to face the master if we're late for his black mass. Soon, sister. I only need one more mark. We have enough for the master. No more are needed. It's not for the master. It's for me. I spent 100 years eating rats and dogs. But oh, soon, buddy. I'll be able to feast. He's wearing the I same armor there, as a star he ready for me. With. And once the mass is done and our lord grants us freedom... I can celebrate by drinking them dry. Cazador promised you your freedom. And you believed him. Ha! You were never burdened with intelligence, Petras. Wow. But your load seems especially light these days. Jesus. Astarian. It, it also, why are you out be. in the daytime? Well, that's no way to welcome back a brother, doll. <laughs> Didn't you miss, you miss me? me? Why would you come back? You got out. You were free. Isn't it obvious, sister? He wants to ascend with the rest of us. He heard about the ritual and the power our master will grant us. So he came back oh, with his tail buddy. between his legs, hoping all would be forgiven. Oh, buddy. <sighs> you always were an idiot. Oh my god! Oh, oh shit. Is he hiding? Tell me! Brother, please! Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Fine. Oh, he hissed. You owe your wretched life to my friend. Now tell me what I need to know. The master is preparing the black mass. Oh beneath shit. Beneath his palace. There's a defiled chapel. It was hidden there the entire time. Hidden from us all. Do you really think you can stop him? I'm the only one who can. 
The sun can't harm me. Casador can't compel me. I don't need to fear him anymore. Now go, before I change my mind about roasting Roast. you, brother. Wow. This isn't over, Astarian. Oh, <laughs> shit. Poor fools. They actually they think, think Casador will save, save them. them. They're no threat to us. And they have no choice but to do Casador's bidding. I pity them. Worst of all, they don't know their fate's already set. <laughs> They're doomed. The only question is whether their lives will be sacrificed to a monster like Casador, or serve a greater purpose. Seven sigils on seven spawn. And Cazador has the other six. We have to face him. And take that power for ourselves. Wow, this line. Sometimes you scare me more than the elder brain does. I mean, they know that I'm the spawn of Ball. I'm saying, let's do it. I knew I could count on you. It's that killer instinct <laughs> I love so much. <laughs> and now we know that Cazador's skulking somewhere beneath the palace. It'll be infinitely easier to track him down. All right, let's go. <gasps> this place stinks of rat blood and despair. Oh my God. I'm sorry. I tried not to fangirl like that. But that was amazing voice acting. Someone there. Let's see if I can lockpick With without pleasure. anyone noticing. Wait. Why? Your lockpicking is attracting attention. Tread carefully. Um, was my cloak? Wait, I thought something was giving me. Hold on. Something was giving me advantage on lock picking rolls and sleight of hand. Did I give that to Jahira? By mistake. Because something I had equipped was giving me. Crux. Oh, Gail should actually have that. But something I had. Was giving me. Sorry, now I'm trying to figure this out. Why do I suddenly not have advantage on sleight of hand? Oh, there's a scene that's coming up that's supposed to be even better fair. 
Oh, I'm running low on camp supplies, too. Okay, but Will, I just realized how he looks in this outfit. Damn. The only thing I changed was the Starian's boot and capes. Boots of apparent death. I wonder if I gave someone those boots by mistake. Or gloves. No, he's still wearing the gloves of dexterity. Interesting. Let me see something. That may have been a Starian's cloak. No, I want Will to defend the people. Says you. Interesting. Huh. Sorry, I was very lost for a second because a Starian Watch normally has, um, a Starian normally Go. has advantage. What did I change? Alright, now we... Oh, we got that answered right away. Listen, something over there. It's got private rooms, music, something over and where? all around pleasant folks, from what I've heard. And if a patron confuses me for a member of staff, I'd probably break his nose. Ah, sure, I scrap. I do want to find the brothel. Okay, let's save. I'm going to do a new save. Because I kind of want to replay that moment. Hey, Rube. An elf. Such temptation. I loved many in my day, but never one so fair. Wow. Grace. Elegance just what? waiting to oh, be Oh, I shattered. think I found the brothel, Oh, all. yes. I know your bliss. I'm sorry, what? A sturdy dwarf. A leather whip. Mercy. She gives. You receive. Or have I misjudged you? Lady? Of course you wouldn't. Who can resist the pleasure of the strap? Once leather meets flesh. Ma'am, I just it's met you. It's Fionn you seek, our stern librarian. She isn't here today, alas. Your penance must wait. Ma'am. Well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink for one, a pair of drow for another. A pair of Choose drow? Choose your sin. I'm no good. Whew. It's too early. It's too early. Wow. I'm going to say this knowing Invictus is right behind me. Are there other options? Twins, yes. Hands of such skill they could turn stone oh, to silk. Your body could suffer. No, not they can't. I mean, massage them. does sound kind of good. They're through the curtain to the right. You'll need coin and stamina in abundance to enjoy their services, but the gold will be as well spent as you are. 
Ma'am. Nisha, our lovely nymph. But she's engaged in the nymph's grotto on the top floor, sweeting. The client's a favorite of hers, too. I doubt you'll be able to tear her away. But we are blessed to have a devil in residence what? at the moment. <gasps> the devil Temporary scene! Guest, Fair, are you still he here? Asked that I send any potential clients his way. Everyone who's paid a visit looks quite changed by the experience. <gasps> Indeed he did. Raphael. Exceedingly the, handsome. The devil scene, and with the devil a voice scene. That could make the foulest blasphemy seem the sweetest hymn. Okay, we gotta save and do the Raphael scene. We're we're getting hold on. This is gonna be a special save. Where where was he again? I forgot. Lovely. Hey, spam. It's a dwarf you crave whipping hand. Lady, we Go just on. had a ten minute Tell conversation. Of course you wouldn't. You Who me? can resist? It's well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink indeed he did. Raphael. Where is Exceedingly he? handsome and with a voice that could make the foulest blasphemy seem the sweetest hymn. Don't mind me, I'm off to ride. I mean, the to try. Raphael. That there's a face I'd remember if I'd seen it. <laughs> Welcome to Charesse's Caress. What can Hoots do for you, stranger? You got a taste for ale, I reckon. Or maybe... Ah, forget it. My new brew could drop you in the wink of a spectator's eye. Oh, you're one of those types. Rude as you are sneaky. <laughs> My business is slinging tankards, not hoarding secrets. I'd like to keep it that way. But you poke some folk hard enough, they're bound to squeal. And Mamzelle Amira there looks about ready to burst. You got it. But the new hooch is off limits. Can't have the Mamzelle leaping down my throat if I go burning yours. Oh, literally, it's all, almost all booze. I'll take coffee, though. I... Oh shit, I can't sell my soul coin. I kind of want to sell this armor. Pleasure to serve. <sighs> okay, uh... Who remembers where the devil is? Boy. Where the fuck is the devil? Damn, is the devil like upstairs? I like how we're just walking around in Baldur's Gate when, uh. Enjoyed it. Um. How do I? Okay. 
Oh, there's signs? Ah, I found the right door. Somebody hit a marker. Well, not somebody. I think you have to be an editor. Nope, that didn't work. Doesn't make any sense. Oh, Is thank you, Fair. Oh, hello. All right. You must hear me, Devil. I will do whatever oh, it damn takes. Damn it! I thought we were gonna bang Raphael. Hi, Kelly. There Good is morning. only one thing in this world that I desire. You do not have it, and you never will. will. You must help me, Raphael. Hi, Jordan. For the sake of my people. What? Hush now, Voss. What are you talking These about, Kelly? These guests may not know it yet, but they want the same thing that you do. And unlike you, they have something of value to offer in return. Oh. Whatever you discuss with this devil, I must hear of it. Find me below in the tap room. I plan to once you're loosed devil. from his claws. Voss. I'm glad you came. Not to my door. Not yet. But to the final reckoning. One more I did thing not before yet. we begin, I though. just got here. For the first time since the Nautiloid, your mind is clear. It's unsettling. I gave you back your privacy by shutting that illithid in your pocket out of your mind. It can't hear us. I brought you here because I'm true to my word, and I can make all of this tadpole business go away. Which means you and your lovely friends can remain blessedly free of tentacles. Let us speak plain. Could you? I'll admit, you've impressed me. I wasn't sure you'd make it this far. But no matter how far you come, you're still on the road to ruin. A road that leads directly to a confrontation with the Elder Brain. At best, it will kill you and everyone else in this city. At worst, it will assimilate you and you won't have enough free will left to even wish you were dead. You have the key to destroying it in the palm of your hand, though. In a manner of speaking, but it's the one inside the prison that you need, not the illithid, the gith. I can give you the means to break him free. The Orphic Hammer, an artifact capable of shattering the chains that hold Prince Orpheus, is held securely in my House of Hope, even now. Isn't it just? And it's even more convenient that you can give me exactly what I want in return. You really do think highly of yourself. Wow. My sights are set on something much wow. more valuable than your soul. <laughs> Succulent, though it would be. I want the crown oh. that dominates the elder we'll go downstairs brain. after this. Handing that crown to this devil will be like feeding gunpowder to a lava worm. Agree to nothing.
power. Ancient and full of wonder. I have craved it ever since the Archwizard Cassus created it long centuries Dying ago. Dying my armor. And brought doom to the Empire of Netheril. That was the great age of humanity. And Netheril's flying sky cities were the apex of civilization. I was there the day it all fell apart. Entire cities plummeted from the sky like angels with broken wings. The screams, oh, the screams. Hundreds of thousands of people watching in horror as the ground <laughs> came up to meet them. <laughs> it was not a happy meeting. And Cassus was responsible. Not driven by malice, but by ambition. He forged a crown imbued with all the powers of magic. A crown that would make any who wore it a god. Men cannot contain so much power. The crown destroyed its creator, and his empire fell with him. Cassus's folly, the bards and scholars call it. I call it hope. The hope of creating a better world, and the perils of unchecked hubris. I knew then that the folly of mortals could be the triumph of devils, and that I could use that crown to unite the Nine under one Archdevil Supreme, me. Wow, everyone just wants power. The Archdevil Mephistopheles snatched up the crown and squirreled it away in one of his vaults. He is not more than a frigid archivist. So much power and potential and kept inert. He made a miracle into a museum piece. I raged. But only for a decade or so. Then I waited. Oh, just a decade. Ever watching for more than a thousand years for a mistake, a mishap, a misadventure. Gosh. And these chosen who have caused you so much trouble accidentally did me a favor. They brought the crown back into play. <sighs> Yes, it does. Especially oh God, when I, I see we what a bloody mess they've made exposition. of their whole scheme. They must have raided Mephistopheles' vault. Impressive, I must admit. But they'll be dead soon. If you don't kill them, the Elder Brain will. It doesn't have feelings in the way you'd understand them. <laughs> but it seems rather angry. It is inevitable. Okay, why does Starry look like he was trying brain, to escape and you that will, because conversation you must. at a party? The crown will be yours for the taking. And when that moment comes, you give the crown to sure. me. Sure. In exchange, I give you the hammer now. What's the catch? A simple transaction, it seems, but it's more than that. He's offering you an alternative to the mind flare in your head. Take Raphael's deal and you could free Orpheus. With Orpheus free, you would have no need to rely on the Emperor. Emperor. But there's no guarantee that Orpheus would be on your side. And if you take the deal, Why is Gale giving me the stink eye back there? You'll have Jesus. to deliver the crown of Carsus to the devil himself. himself. He claims his ambition is to unite the Hells, but can he be trusted to stop there? Do you trust him more than you trust the Emperor? Well, I am playing an... <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna quick save before I make this choice.
I don't know. I've caught him giving uh, a Starian kind of a look when I've kissed a Starian in front of him. And Gale, Gale's weapon is just glowing. Well, I forget a Starian, I think, is actually taller than Gale. Somehow the game has let me uh, still romance both of them. I'm making this choice. Of course, we're lying, but... Right here. You'll find everything is in order. Uh. Oh no, I can't read Infernal. Shit. The moment I have your signature, you will have the means to free Orpheus. The hammer. You guarantee the crown will be mine once the oh, brain is defeated. No. And I swear that I will never use the crown to dominate a mortal. I'm not mortal. I'm just like... He's like, do I do this? You know what? Fuck it. In for a penny, in for a pound. And it's starry inside it, not me. I like that we're Perfect. signing shit we can't read. One more rhyme, for old time's sake. The master was slain within his own house. They dined on him wow. both the cat and the mouse. The hammer is yours. You will find yourself in Orpheus's presence before the end comes. When you do, shatter the chains that hold him. Be sure to keep the hammer safe until then. Your survival depends on it. And I'll keep your contract safe in my house. Wow, Zero. I'll be seeing you. And when I do, we dine. Um, excuse me, sir. Wherever this house of hope is, we need to go there immediately and destroy that Gail, contract. Gail, he can hear you. We must find the Diabolist. Only one well-versed in devilry will know the way. Gail, he's right there. He can hear you. Destiny waits in the wings. Find the brain. Destroy it. And seize that crown. I... <clears throat> I want to talk to you. Well, that ends. Not as bad Was as I bad. just outside the whole time? Don't waste the step. Destiny waits in the uh. wings. Find the brain. Destroy it. And seize that crown. But, but you have a nice pool here. There you are. I thought I'd lost you. Something was blocking me from hearing your thoughts. Oh, you don't want to know those impure thoughts. I can understand that. There's reprieve in solitude. But it's concerning that something could intervene like that. Especially when we are so close uh, to yes. the underbrain. Do you have any idea what it was? Not a clue. Oh, shit. <laughs> Nat 20, yo. Then the situation is worse than I thought. If it read your thoughts, like, well, it knows we exactly lying. what your intentions are. And it is already plotting counter moves to stop you. We must press on. I'm trying Where to go to bed with, with Raphael. Defenses. Let us hope that allows us to regain some of our lost advantage before it finds you. Not me just getting in bed like it's my bed. Oh? Oh? Hold on. Hold, please. Gemma? Anything of use? Ugh, 
I'm gonna die that shit immediately. Mermaid whiskey, uh, yes please. Okay, how come I can steal directly from Raphael's room? But... Can I try, no, I probably shouldn't try to charm him. Destiny waits in the wings. Ah, he won't say anything Find else. the brain, destroy it, and seize that crown. Well, shit. Okay, okay, so hold on, though. Astarian's eccentric clothes? Hold on, where did this outfit go? Strapped choker leather ensemble. Now I kind of want to just go to camp, just cuz. I literally just put an outfit on Gale, that's why. Oh, that's because I gave it to Gale. Oh, this is going to be hilarious. I feel like, okay, I got it. I guess maybe I can't ride the devil later. Um, Kelly, if you're still here... That was the upper floor, and there was not anywhere else to go. You'll have to forgive me, but I'm struggling to understand why you'd agree to just hand over the crown. I'm asking Kelly Especially where they are because Kathy. she's found them. Hammer. Oh, yes, of course. I can see how the hammer we didn't know existed until Raphael generously enlightened us would take precedence. He's always struck me as the trustworthy type. I promise you, whatever outcomes we're hoping for in this world-ending endeavor of ours, letting that devil get hold of the crown must not be one of them. No. What we should be pursuing is knowledge. We need to learn more about that crown. We should pay a visit to Sorcerer's Sundries. Their book collection is the envy of the Sword Coast. I'm certain the truth lurks somewhere on their shelves. I haven't had to eat a, an artifact of since Elminster showed up. <laughs> Nethery sex but I was specifically asking that. Kelly so if she's still here since she just... I doubt they'll have any books on breaking contracts with devils, though. We'll have to figure that one out for ourselves. Since she mentioned it and has been there. Yes, that's part of his whole character thing. Okay, so there's that. Elminster's library. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, Gale leveled. What did I do? Okay.
Oh shit, I get level 5 spells. I get cloud kill. I get dominate person. Target an otherworldly creature and attach its consciousness to your own. It will follow you and fight as an ally. I get telekinesis. Wall of Stone. Cloud Kill. Get rid of that because it never actually helps me. And Witch Bolt is useless at this point. Greater invisibility. I've already got greater invisibility. No, I don't have greater invisibility. Get rid of Wall of Fire. It's not as. I am going to keep Polymorph, however. I guess. We're going to lockpick. Okay, something is weird because make any sense. A Starian should down. have Oh father, give me strength. A Starian should have um I don't care what he's offering. I wouldn't have been so quick to sign with the devil. Then again, it's not my name on the it page. It is your name on the page. So you what signed it. I care? A brothel. Then through. Pleasure house. library. Quite ready for you. Oh, willing you say? Could be interesting. Also. Why is Elminster's library in a brothel? I need to understand this. Why are we in a brothel? I know, we're just like, Astarian, please. Yeah, but there was no mention. Oh, okay. There was no mention of Elminster even being here. Oh, this is the roof, literally. Okay. I got it. I got it. Thanks. I'm gonna quick save before I lockpick. Elminster's not who she was talking about. Elminster is a different wizard. Let's not correct people on spelling. Oh, you corrected yourself. Okay. But still. Dom. Dom doesn't make a difference. Where is she? Ma'am, where are you? So, uh, yeah, this might get a little NSFW. Tell me. Am I beautiful? I do have nudity on. More than beautiful. 
You are the aurora stretched across the north skies. You are the golden dunes swept across okay, the Okay, this cabin. underwear is kind of fancy, though. You are the fruit of the forbidden palm. Soft on my skin. Sweet on my tongue. You are my sin. And salvation. Oh, hello. Your parasite stirs. And you gaze at the nymph through the flaming fist's hungry eyes. Your muscles shiver with her longing. Your skin burns with her heat. What's... What's wrong, Jara? What are you... Wait. I know you. I most certainly do. Jara is the most valued. Your face. The Absolute has shown me. Jara, what's going on? Who's this man? Oh, shit. Your head screams in agony. The change has come. Pustules boiling beneath your skin, your bones twisting, your flesh rupturing. And suddenly, silence. What's happening? I'm sorry, what? Kelly, you did not tell me that there was a fucking mind flare here. Said Urza Gadojai, that was not no gloom. what I was gloom. thinking at all. Well, Oh, you slowed us. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, well. Oh, time to shatter. Another fight. Let's go. This isn't even a fair fight. Oh, shit, everyone leveled. <laughs> I mean, you're watching when I'm pretty much near end game, so. Protection from evil and good has been no use. Neither is heroism. I Command has not been worth anything. I'm... I got nothing. I don't get much for a star in at level 9. Defender of the people. Which means everyone at camp is gonna level whenever I go back.
Oh, I can speak with dead without a spell slot. Let's be creepy. Let's be absolutely creepy. Where's Will? Speak with dead. Where? Where? Let's do it. The corpse has nothing to say. <gasps> you son of a bitch! Keep a blade close. I've got a long road ahead. You. Son of a bitch, I wasted to speak with dead. I should speak up. Hells, I'd heard tales of mind flayers. Talons sharp as daggers and tentacles yet more fearsome. But no tale did justice to its ethereal Lady? beauty. Lady? It floats like a butterfly. Its blood shimmers like silver. How could I help it? I don't regret its death. But I marvel that such a work of art could ever live. Her gaze intensifies. Your breath quickens and your heart skips a beat. The woman's senses are heightened and her fire stoked. The mind flare is no mere curiosity, but an object of desire. Why should I deny it? My urge is as natural as the grape upon the vine. But perhaps there are other flavors that might satisfy my palate. Rapture. Close your eyes. And listen. Astarian's eyes are already closed. Hold on. Will's eyes are not. You see only darkness. Her voice shines through it, warmer than the sun, yet cooler than night. The all being here. There is no suffering here. Man, I wonder if Carlac was here. Here, you are anything. You have one word. Tell me, what will you be? Ooh. Powerful. You are more than powerful. An emperor to emperors, your head adorned with a crown of gold, diamond, and ruby. The heavens tremble with the steps of your army. All beasts, all men and women, all creatures of the plains bow to your might. Your flesh shivers, your heart bursts. True ecstasy for one fleeting moment. Open your eyes. I'll remember you, and you'll remember me. If you seek rapture, find it elsewhere. I can show you but once. Oh, okay then. I guess. Well, these boots have seen everything. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, yeah. I want to give it a good rum. 
Oh, it's our little uh, Oliphant. Oh, Kithrak. Oh, can I talk to Valeria? Well, another case closed, another bottle open! Huzzah to Valeria! <laughs> Hang on a tick. I recognize that face. You were talking to Yanis after I left the temple. I bet she's put you up to something. Why must you busybodies insist on interrupting a perfectly good night? <sighs> I know that look. You remind me of Devella. Fine. If you doubt my conclusions, out with it. What have you found? While that is startling, it still doesn't disprove my theory that Brilgore killed Father Lorgan, does it? I need proof. Hard proof. A motive, too. Otherwise, I'm afraid the case remains closed. <sighs> New guy. Tell me you took the devil's deal. Tell me you will free Gith's heir. How can it be that you came to possess it? Was it Raphael? The Prince of the Comet is not dead. The Prince of the Comet will come again. The Prince of the Comet will liberate us from the Lich Queen's tyranny. Can it be? Will the mighty Prince Orpheus soon illuminate the astral plane? Among the Githyanki, one gift is esteemed above all others. The Silver Sword. Take it. Wield it in honor of Gith, the great liberator, and her unforgotten son. Right? Istik, now that you have the hammer, you must find a way to enter the Astral Prism. Once inside, smash Orpheus's bonds. His cry will shake the plains, and I will fly to your aid. The Prince of the Comet will sear the heavens again. Let the Lich Queen tremble! Okay. Think again. I will not permit your entry. Questions, Istik? You seem to be lost in thought. The Prince of the Comet aches for Githyanki liberation more than he abhors Geich. He might seethe when you free him. He might gnash his teeth and slander your name. But he will see reason. I promise you. Yes, but you will meet this challenge. I'm glad you're sure you've of met this. so many others. Okay, so now we've gone from you are my dream lover, literally. And hey, you paid Raphael a visit. I want to hear all about it. Ma'am, there was nothing that happened, you nosy bitch. Come to pay your respects to the real lady of the house, wow. I see. What a clever creature you are. It's your lucky day. 
I am receiving compliments at this time, and you are most welcome to make an offering. Oh, you are quite correct. I consider them one of my finest features. The unwashed rabble who frequent this establishment have much to learn from your deference. And I must suffer their foibles alone. But they do say a burden shared is a burden halved. The Drow, two of our most popular courtesans. A night with them seems to be rather life-changing, if you can afford it. Of course, they are siblings. But judging oh, from shit. the throngs of clients they draw, most of the city is as disgusting as they are. Can't you hear from here? They're talking about the new top cat in the criminal underbelly. Go and listen for yourself. As for them personally, one never washes and instead douses himself with rose oil, while the other can't hold his drink. That's rather a broad topic. We get all sorts here. But there is one frequent visitor whose very presence offends me. He dresses fabulously, but stinks oh no. of the hells. Something infernal, to be sure. Abhorrent. Your time, Spoon. Cow. Oh, sorry. Well, wow. oh, I Animal. hate the new boys. Don't I don't understand why there's such a type for so many. It's a dwarf you crave, Lady. whipping hand. Go on, tell me I'm wrong. Am I? It's fee on you seek. Well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink for one, a pair of drow for another. Choose your sin. Swishing. I'm no fortune teller. If truth is, Fion's gone well missing. And my hands may be skillful, but they were not made to turn every last stone she might be hiding behind. To service is my calling, not to be served. Ugh. But I'd be a fool to say no. The girl kept my coffers near overflowing. Two flights up, then turn right, and right again. That's Fionn's pleasure room, Elminster's library. <sighs> Here, take the key. Elminster's library? People will get their thrills in the strangest of places. I'm listening. Indeed he did. Raphael. Exceedingly handsome, and with a voice that could make the foulest blasphemy seem the sweetest hymn. All right, I guess we we talk into the Drow twins. Actually, let's go check the room first. Just salty. There's a difference. Much better to make drinks. I love the fact that I already broke in this room.
I'll just help myself. Enjoyed it. <laughs> Sir, I had no less than two maidens and a bunch of clawing us my door. Wait, is there a place up here too? They really make you work for this fucking place. I also want to go to camp because what did I take off of a stock? I got a one? Excuse me? Starian does not get ones. Oh. I, I broke into. Whoops. Sorry, Raphael. Broke into your room. Sorry. Don't mind me. Well. I didn't, but I, oh, I need to leave. I don't mind it. Honestly. Well, I do. Which means we're getting a real room. Stupid bridge guards. Should have dumped a lot of them. Interesting. What do you reckon, lad? You trust these steel watcher thingamajigs? Oi, I'll second that. It's all right where well, we can get work repairing them, but what happens when they build something else to do that? Ah, it's no good, I tell you. Oh, I've just got the key. Oh, it's... The washroom. Literally. That's all that's there is a washroom. <laughs> ah, there's a better. You can actually turn down the number of NPCs fair. Okay, so I'm up on a whole other floor. If you still find me stealing. No, you didn't. Interesting. Yeah, you can turn down like the ambient crowds. 
You can also turn down the ambient noise. Like, I can go into settings. What the? What in the? It would appear so. Scarlet leather armor. An app with Father Logan's name. Seems the shapeshifters were all over the tunnels he used. Messy splatters of deep red brown adorn the scrap of parchment. Those wishing to face the Dread Lord's Tribunal and enter the Temple of Baal must slay the targets on this list and frame the corpses as a murder by the Cult of the Absolute. Bring the victim's hand as a proof of the killing. Walk in blood, aspirant. Dick Belen Stellman, Father Lorgan, Dribbles the Clown. Alexander Rainforest, killed. All of them killed. Except. Cora Highbury, Figaro Pennygood, Chef Revere. Nesha Lisha, Vadi Vantham, Vantampur, Friedrich Hewn. Huh. Oh, yes, you were running low with your 80 million of them. Perception failed. Ooh. Ah, those are the doors I just saw. Good boy. Huh. Interesting. I learned something yesterday watching um, Luke's stream. Who was here when I ran into the toll collector? Um, in the Shadow Curse Lands. You've been pulling all nighters to keep watch. I know you have. I don't mind it, honestly. Well, I do, which means we're getting a real room. <laughs> Ah, well, there is a very creepy toll collector. Oh, return to the Temple of Baal. Where is Valeria? Um. But they're they're basically one of Catholic Thorns children
Well, two of them are in. Uh, I was just talking out loud. Uh, a lot of times I do that, Picara. I was not literally asking for help. I talk out loud quite a bit. Another case closed, another bottle open. Huzzah to Valeria! <laughs> Hang on a tick. I recognize that face. You were talking to Yanis after I left the temple. I bet she's put you up to something. Why must you busybodies insist on interrupting a perfectly good night? Ugh. I know that look. You remind me of Devella. Fine. If you doubt my conclusions, out with it. What have you found? A ball plot. You as well. Well... Devella's been harping on about Baal for months. Oh boy. Fancies herself something of an expert. Well, I it was do I have bad news for you? I have such bad news for you. But she's been unusually insistent about this one, even for her. <sighs> Fine. I'll bite. What's your theory? Oh no. How heavy is that? Zero? Constable Devella is going to be a real pain in the trunk about this. <laughs> Since you seem to be on an obnoxiously similar wavelength, why don't you seek her out? She'll be at the Elf Song Tavern. Show her the list, and I'll stay and inform the fist here. Oh, and you'll need this pass. It'll give you access the to lower the lower city. city. One second. Well, what are you waiting for? You've a bloody conspiracy to solve. Move. You have the key to my eye. It's been with it, bro. One moment. Isn't right. Oh my god, they're already calling for panels for GDC next year. All right, I'm gonna leave you all for a hot second. I'm going to get a quick bio. I'm actually gonna put up the BRB. Let's see if OBS wants to act right. And uh, I will be right back. I'm just gonna get a quick bio and also get something to, to eat that is not crunchy chips. Right. 
try it. It on especially for you. Don't take a new guy from trouble. I want to give it a good rumple. Yeah, yeah, you got that right. The guild. Isn't right. I put it on especially for you. Don't take it off later. Game. I wanna give it a good rumple. One chicken win. New guy in trouble. Oh, yeah, oh, I can tell you that. Uh, yeah, 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 you got that right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The guild. Yeah. That's why, huh? You're tying the spoon. Cut out. Oh, no, sorry. Be not careful. You have the key to my own. I put it on especially for you. Don't take it off later. I want to give it a good rumple. We are not in trouble, sister. Remember our vow to keep one another safe. When the music stops, you and I. Continue to visit Ireland. Be rid of that drone. Yeah, no, no. Isn't right. Yes, I don't on his leash. Game. He's playing. Yeah, yeah. One chicken win. The key to my heart in that. I put it on the new guy for you. Mm -hmm. Don't yeah, take it off later. I'll give it a good rumple. The guild. Yeah. That's my heart. Your tongue spoon. Cut out. Oh, no, sorry. Now he's in the I don't know if he's 
be rid of that broom. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't right. You have the key <laughs> to my heart. Now on his leash. <laughs> I put it on especially for you. Game. Don't play. I'm back. Not sure why, but I can't edit. I can't change my um my mixer's suddenly just not working. It's like it disconnected. But you all can still hear me talking, yeah. Yeah, the time hasn't changed on it. Um Okay, well, at least the mixer is working that much. But it is definitely... Um... Okay, I investigated the flop house. Also, what's... Oh, I've got Rapture. Until next long rest. Okay. Cool, cool. Oh, that's outside. I don't want to go outside. I do want to talk to the Drow twins, though. You have the A new face? Looking for another chapter of dirty law for your biography? You have but to ask, and we can grant you a moment of pleasure. Don't be shy. I used to work as a courtesan back home, and my sister as an artisanal masseuse, but... Men are treated like dogs by the Underdark's matriarchs, so we fled. We found surfaces crave the body of a drow like a drug. Life is easy in our line of work. Oh my god, this line! Look at us, we're immaculate. Life is prosperous. I'm much happier kissing the many lips of the surface than tending a field or manning a shop. I'd have to restrain myself far more than any playbindings do if I worked in another field. This is a place where I can be myself boundlessly. There are so many who come to me speaking of a fixation wow. that no one else has ever been able to share with them. And never will again. A once-in-a-lifetime moment of passion. Every day. Well. What could be better? Don't you want to try it? Trust me, you don't want to miss my signature Mezzo Baranzan love trick. 
Men's Oberanzan love magic, a formidable practice, usually only reserved for pleasing the most insatiable matriarchs in the city of spiders. I'm not even a wolf swan. And is that your partner with you? What a gorgeous couple. Perhaps we could come to an agreement. Oh. Oh. I think Gail, because Gail's right behind me. Well, there are two of us, aren't there? Use your imagination. All right, I know that there's some dialogue that happens here. The question is who's going to respond as my partner? This is all a bit much for me. Back home in Waterdeep, I prefer to have Tara leave the room before I undress. Oh shit! Oh shit, why is Gail the option? Oh, I'm gonna persuade the fuck out of Gail. Or not. Oh, we're using. We're using. Oh shit, I got a 29. I might enjoy watching you tangled up with the drow. As long as I was five paces back. Charming. There must be a sprinkling shower of gold. <gasps> oh <first>. jeez! <coughs> Coin. This is costing me so much money. Okay, I need to understand this before I say yes to the money. I have given Astarian way more attention, kissed him every opportunity, let him feed on me. He's standing at my right hand, but they're talking about Gale. I barely talk to Gail. I don't even take him with me half the time. Hey, Tom. Uh, you're in time for some uh, threesome action, just so you know. Hopefully you are at home and this will not be a thing that will bother you. I'm about to spend a th about half our money on a good time. Let's go. This is thrilling. What, where are we going? On my way. I like that we're following these drow. Oh, how is Palea? I can't install it. fact that if you're following them they know ex everyone knows where you're going
Oh. Oh boy. So this is happening. As much as I enjoy when others watch, that wasn't included in the price. Oh. Oh. So, uh, Will, you're gonna have to leave. Best foot forward. Careful, S I might. Sorry, Astarian. Quick step. Interesting. I have something to ask. Quite the merry little party we have assembled here. I don't Shall know how we? this is going to go. I hope you're not afraid of the dark, my darling. I must snuff out the lights before we begin. It's all part of the experience. The room is bathed in total darkness. So there is nothing to distract from your ecstasy. The lady, Nim, moves your hand to where the clasps of her blouse lie. As soon as you begin, you hear a zap of magic over from where Gale last was. With a scamper, he's gone from the room. Oh. And in his place is... Hello. I'm here on behalf of Gale of Waterdeep to participate in this evening's activities. He would like me to assure you all that I am anatomically accurate. Oh, an illusory wizard. <laughs> Fear not. There are still many things we can do with you. I cannot. I am involved. I'm taking notes, making observations. I'll enjoy myself well enough from back here. You go on and do the rutting or what have you. As you enjoy yourself with the drow, the image of Gale tuts disapprovingly. But the orb in his naked chest glows with telltale excitement. Wait, I paid a thousand gold and we don't even get a cutscene? Are you fucking for real? I'm sorry, what? Give me a moment for pity's sake. You've exhausted me already. We recover quickly, but not that quickly. <sighs> Even in the best of times, I hate you, Zero. It's an oasis of pleasure and calm in the city's chaos. With Baldur's Gate preparing for war, the caress feels like the final flicker of a beautiful flame before darkness falls. Wow. Wow. Go. The, they just stood out here the whole time. Precious little ball, babe. I. The thing that will decide my fate forevermore. Yes, it's been on my mind. Why? You snarky little asshole. I hadn't really decided on the specifics. Obviously, we could stop the ritual. 
Oh. Not. What? <laughs> I've obviously thought about it. If I was the one who completed the ritual, I'd have such power. And I could walk in the sun without fear I'd turn into a mind flare. Of course, I don't even know if I could complete the ritual. It may be impossible, but it certainly is tempting. Oh my god, fair! <laughs> I was just wondering when you'd invite me back for a bite. Us. I still love the, the sound, sound of that. that. How could I say no? So, game. I have no mods, by the way. This isn't like Dragon Age where I modded the game to romance everyone. Oh. <laughs> I do rather like that, you know. Okay. Okay, we've got that going on. I don't think we're even properly in Baldur's Gate. I think we are just in this other town. I just need fruit, vegetables. What can I do you for? Man, you don't have like potions. I'm still mad I spent all that money. Oh, I can't sell that. I almost sold it. Damn, you ain't got no actual food? Like, actual potions? If you're hungry, you know where to find me. Okay, Legolas. Take a deep breath for me. Rober and stilts. I swear to God, if you don't have potions... You look like someone whose soul needs feeding. Care to buy some art? What the fuck I need art for? Oh, but you've got potions. You've got dye. Okay, I need to know... Oh wait, I don't... I want to just... I just want to buy things. What color is dark amethyst? Baby blue and gold is too obnoxious. I hate pink and green. I'm not stealing. I'm not stealing his clothes. Catherick's Warhammer after all you go through to fight that man. The colors don't confuse me. Die remover though. I'm not selling Will's armor. Do come again. 
Get you out here, fresh off the Edo. Oh my god, I should put a star in pink and green armor. Tim. That seems like a lot. Do you not wish to pleasure your fine maiden? To I'm saying it. Did they just say, "Do you not wish to pleasure your fine maiden"? Good. No, I personally hate pink and green, so it will never happen. I just said it's a thing I should do. Calms, calms. Wait, hold on. Oh no, the armor I saw was something I think. I need you to calm down. Put him up! Put him up! Yay! You spoke to me! Nobody ever talks to me! Your fist, silly! I'm trying something out! My name's Narber, adventurer to be, soon to be the best adventure anyone's ever seen. As soon as I figure out what kind of adventure I want to be. What do you think? Can I be a fighter? Oh, I'm going to enjoy this. <laughs> Sorry. I could not give a less of a shit. Oh, uh, all right then. Uh, s sorry to bother you. They're like this super fan character oh, that's a nod. Thanks for stopping by. The previous calm, games, calm. apparently, because I looked them I'm up. Calm. Well, calm men. <laughs> what can I do you for? Sounds good. Get you something a bit fresher than your current outfit. Wow. Rude heifer? Oh, please tell me there's just plain black dye. That's all I want. Jesus Christ. Why does this game not just have simply black dye? I beg of you, game. Just let me buy clothes. Black and jade. Uh, this may be the die that I want. You can have those. I'm not selling Starian's clothes, though. Spring Slim Fit? Are we for real right now? Jay, how is new computer life treating you? Oh god, the lemon, lime, lemon, and lichen is disgusting. Black and azure. Yes, I know I'm buying 8 billion bottles of dye, I don't care. And I'm going to sell that, sell these arrows because I've not managed to do anything with them. 
because I've also spent most of my money. I feel like somebody can already cast Circle of Death. Absolutely not selling that after all I went through. Get it. Gale can cast that now, so I'm gonna actually sell that scroll. And he can cast that now too. So JA, you missed some shenaniganry. I might have visited the brothel in town. Remember, Carms Garms, here for all your fashion needs. I kind of want to go up and punch that character. Wow, wow, fair, wow. Fair, I need you to send me that clip ASAP. I kind of want to put it in Eugenio's mod chat, but I kind of don't. Can I unarm strike him? Oh, I wish I was a monk right now. Oh, if you put it there, that's fine. So it is getting to be close. To oh my God. Sorry. But good armor is hard like to find. Maybe I could wear it to yeah, dinner with your folks. Which makes him the inventor. How about we settle on the Gondians and the trash invented them? Sorry. Let them see you taking charge of your pleasurable destiny. If it ain't broke, it's because we already helped you fix it. <laughs> Sorry, I've gotten a couple texts. Well, we're shopping for a suit. Dinner with my parents, remember? This armor was such a bargain. We can't return it. Simply as. Darn it. I got it. I got it. And thanks. Sorry, I got a couple texts that I needed to reply to. Oh, I don't know if you saw my clip. You told me the armor was a bargain. It was. Of um. Need something? I've got the tools for any job. Any job. Okay, lady, calm down. Uh. Wow, you have fuck all that I need. You don't have tools for any job. Whatever you're working on, oh, that fixes it for you. I didn't buy anything, Jesus. If it ain't broke, oh it's no. You fix it. <laughs> Are we? Wow. Oh boy. Well, we won't be fighting our way into town here. You know what? It's nice. It's it's. Look at that. Look at the time. We should yeah. go. So they were which makes him the inventor. How about we settle we on the Gondians and... Ah, uh, Kelly. Apparently. A hero is nothing without the right equipment. See Danthelon's dancing axe for all your adventuring needs. Karlak was like, I'm gonna ride you till the wheels fall off. No, Tim. That seems like a lot. Danthelon's dancing axe. Our stock isn't used. It's tried and tested by the finest of Greetings, sir. Your noble bearing brings a little class to my humble establishment. How may I be of service? First, what do you have to trade? Gauntlets of the War Master. I might need that later. 
Oh no. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Oh, I'll be encumbered if I buy that? I need to go to camp and get rid of some shit. I hate to give away something made for a drow, but I am keeping Catholic's Warhammer though. I'm so sorry. Oh, blessings. You have everything I need. Uh, I'm going to buy all of them. <laughs> Grilled cormorant. Good to know. I can imagine. I'm so sorry. Gale has Featherfall, but he's not with us. Well, you have literally nothing useful. All right. Blightbringer. Oh, but it's specifically dwarves and gnomes. Why? Why are you not proficient? All right. What we're going to do. Short father, bless you. We're going to go to camp. We're not going to talk to these Warforged. Because one Warforged and a bunch of them nearly, nearly took us out. Where am I needed? Um... I did not sell Catholic's Warhammer, okay. Wow, look at me having all. Oh, it's an evening outfit, okay. All right, so. I don't need Bull to do that, I need a star in. I don't think it's show. I think it's a quest item, so they're keeping me from selling it. Oh no, we are not. No. And now that I know that Gale is very much like, I am not okay with this. That made literally no change. Is this not diable? Hey Raven, how are you? Hi Jeff. Did we get a raid and I was so deep into what we were doing, I absolutely missed it. I'm so sorry if I did. <sighs> okay, I'm asking because I honestly don't know. What color is amethyst?
Oh, I need to put Lazelle in the party so I can actually... Thank you. So I honestly was like, the fuck color is this? The hero at heart. Also, who got the die remover? Alright, I also need to put some stuff into... Okay, because I'm my brain is just not a dag nabbit. Um, because I am keeping an eye on the time. I do need to log into work soon ish. Oh. Cause I've also got a lance that While I do enjoy all the dyes. Okay. I'm gonna put this in here because Will can cast it at will. I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep those for boss fights. Cause that feels like a thing we should do. I'm going to put some of these poisons and potions in here until I use them. Oh, Gail. There is a flail called the Blood of Lathander that I could have picked up. I did not manage to get the blood of the thunder. Okay, sorry. I'm. I was super focus mode. Uh, I need to carry that. Um. Need my potions of animal speaking. I'm going to give that to Lazelle, so. Ocean blue, pale green, purple. That goes in there. I don't know. I bought it, and now I'm like, why did I buy it? Also, I'm losing, so. I'm going to keep that in storage for now. Okay. Why do I feel... Actually, I'm going to give that to Will. I know this isn't super exciting, y'all. I'm sorry, not sorry. But uh, Invictus is near encumbrance. Oh, it doesn't go there. Okay, then. Okay, that's Will's original armor. That's an extra set of that for some reason. Definitely don't want those clothes. I'm gonna leave that in my pack. But I'm carrying so much stuff. I 
I have two of all of the Twitch things, because for some reason... Uh, I didn't want the clothing chest game. Why? Astarian, I need you to also figure out why you don't have advantage on all your sleight of hand anymore. Let's hope for gold. Seriously. This stuff Astarian's carrying, like, why do you have this? Um, Infernal Ore, he doesn't need that. I just need one lantern. Oh, he has the Orphic Hammer. Uh, Gale, can, Gale and Will can cast Sleep. I'm gonna leave that. I have four scrolls of Speak of Dead. Nobody needs to be carrying that many. I got that early in the game and I have no idea what it's for. But my magpie ways have now come to catch up with me. Cobalt is a very bright blue. Black and Azure is a type of blue. I don't know why I bought the pale pink. Gale can cast... Oh, I'm definitely saving that for later. Oh, we might need that. Definitely need that. I have no regular healing potions anymore. This is my not so inner magpie. Gail. I applaud your taste. Gail, I'm gonna, step. I'm gonna need you to chill. Yes, why not? I'm also trying to. I really, it really is bugging me. Of what is it I could have given away that took away Astarian's advantage on sleight of hand tricks. That is an obnoxious color. I'm not sure what this is, but I can cast this already. Gale's austere clothes. Well, Gail, you and your austere clothes can... He has fly, but it's not prepared. And you're the only one with, uh...
Yes, I am. And he's wearing it, but I lost... I lost that. Um, Trust no one. I lost that for some reason when we were in town. I had it on. I haven't taken it off of him. But I somehow lost advantage on sleight of hand. Yep. He is wearing the graceful cloth. I don't know if it's because I now have a dex of 20. Oh, I already took care of Asterion. Okay. Alright. So that's progress. Let's talk to Jahira. I need a quick word. Watching gods. But I never thought I would be happy to Maybe. see the city again. <laughs> Much less to smell it. The Harper safe house I spoke of is on the bridge at Worms Crossing. Danthelon's dancing axe. Oh, I've got to get rid of someone. Will, quickly, you need to leave the party for a moment. Where are you? What? Is Lazelle over there just chilling? Oh shit, I need to get rid of some- I need to get rid of Will for a hot second. Gail, why are you invisible, friend? Fuck is Will. I keep missing Will. Well met. I met her twice. The first time I was a boy of seven or eight at a banquet in the Flaming Fist's honor. Yeah, it's not applying because I did not have... Chestnut hair that flowed behind her like willow fronds as she floated from one room to the next as if carried by clouds. The second time, Stelmane was different. Even with the aid of a cane, each step she took was a struggle. Every word she spoke took great physical effort. A stroke victim, I asked father later. <laughs> no, he said. A Sorry, stroke survivor. Sorry, fair, I just got your message. You sense uncertainty in Will's voice. He questions fair, his father's menace, explanation. Fair, you're a menace, and I love you. Jesus, what kind of ridiculous charisma? Something's always gnawed at me. At the banquet, Stelmay didn't seem to look at us, but through us. But that second time, her gaze never left me. It was steel, sharp and unyielding. It could just be my imagination, but I always felt that it was more than a stroke that had changed her. What, though? I couldn't say. I couldn't say, but think about this. My father was tadpole. Stelmane is dead. The people are frightened and the council And after that disarray. great heartwarming chat. To exert control, you must first sow chaos. A tyrant strategy, as father would say. These murders aren't random acts. Someone powerful is guiding the killer's hand, and the city is made weaker for it. Mind flayers are like devils. They just sport tentacles rather than wings. Clever, manipulative, exploitative. <coughs> the Emperor says he's a friend. <coughs> I think we'd be fools to believe him. And maybe it's true. Maybe Stelmane allied with a mind flayer and subjected the city to their political will. Or maybe he made an offer she couldn't refuse. Hey, Duchess. Are you sure? The blade stands at the ready. Yes, because I... And just when things were warming up. Because of the ridiculous way that the game makes me manage encumbrance. Not encumbrance, oh my god. Well, Inventory. are we ready for the road once more? As you wish. Whatever it takes. 
Uh, Duchess, do I know you IRL? Yeah, that's a little too, uh... Personal, shall we say? I, I just don't snuggle with everybody. Yeah, we like to get to know folks here in the chat first. Um, 